ready to wave a goodbye and we're looking at 2015 and also some of the trends that we can look forward to. Now, we need the experts for this and here our decor expert is in our studio to talk about decor tips for 2015. In walks, Belle Ross, welcome to the show. Thank you for having me. Let's get straight into it. Top decor tips or even things to look at for 2015. What do you suggest? I think everyone knows that it's Decor landscapes have been dominated by luxury in the past. We now move into a far more frugal usage of resources. Um, it's almost like we've gone on a big diet. The design industry's gone on diet. Everything's becoming pared down, exposed, thinner padding. Um, obviously, all sustainable materials only go for, and also very exciting materials. People are starting to experiment a lot with 3D printing because of all the new print, um, materials that we have available to us. Um, and in, in materials, have become like their own trend really. I'm glad you said 3D printing, it's something that I'm interested in. Yeah. But why do you think Africa is on trend? Why is Africa on trend? Because just look at this country, it's, mm. it's just bursting with creativity. And I also think that our colours, our textures, our craft techniques, they have a sense of authenticity. They have that I think that's why the rest of the world are really paying attention to it. Because they can play with it, they can, they can reinvent it, they can take it into the future really. I was online yesterday and I was shopping for South African designers and I saw that most of the pages still have, you know, the usual that we normally used to, but which South African designers from a decor perspective are on your radar at the moment? Um, there's so many, but I think I'd have to start off with Dr. and Mrs. They're really, yeah. it's a young couple in Joburg, they're really, everything, everything they bring out, it's always fresh, it's, it's the way they're looking at things is really, it's really what our, our decor and design industry needs. So mm. I encourage everyone to look, you know, <laughs> how they're doing. But obviously they're lots, Lyle Strong, um, Sprung, Zandre Creel, the girls from Anatomy, um, the list goes on. We really, we've got a really talented set coming through, which is very exciting. And it's interesting how we see the pairs come together. Huh? Yeah. Normally a designer is singled out as just one person, but now there's like a creative and another one that just brings amazing African everything to us. Yeah, no, I think collaboration is definitely the way forward. Mm. bring two different skill sets, different ideas, and then you just make the best of it. How do we survive the festive season? <gasps> the festive season is, I mean, we, it's too much of everything. There's too much food, there's too much partying, there's too much family, might I say it. <laughs> so we need to, you don't need to be overindulgent mm. with your decor. I think this season I'm paring it down. Um, don't have to buy everything from a box. Go out into your garden, cut it, arrange it, spray paint it. Um, doesn't mean it doesn't have to look fabulous, but so just throw in a lot of gold, a lot of gold, a lot of green, and you can't go wrong. Yeah, you see, you don't have to buy everything, no. you can find it right there. Yeah. I love what you said about South Africa, how we are becoming smaller, less, no luxury, you know, it's almost like we're becoming greener and just doing yeah. what's around us. No, we are. And, mm. and it, I mean, buy, buying local, buying local materials, designers sourcing locally for their products, it's definitely where we're going. Okay, well, you've got an amazing book and magazine, Bell, joining us this morning, giving us some tips on what to do for 2015 in terms of decor. And uh, do you like cheesecake? I do. But you're not eating at the moment. No. She's getting married, so she doesn't want to eat cheesecake. <laughs> Belle, thanks for joining us this Thank morning. You, I eat lots of cheesecake. <laughs> you and what's happening?